Oh, hey! You know they say you learn from failure, right? Well, <clears throat> let's just say I've been doing a lot of learning. Behold! The rough meal with its 50 pounds of packaging. <clears throat> Sorry, environment. Rough ball. Fun for a whole six seconds. And smell a vision, which was a bit too, how shall we say, skunky. But the past is past, and the future is my can't fail moneymaker. Meat and fruit smoothies. Yay! Yes, we are going to sell a boatload of smoothies. And not one of those tiny squeaky toy boats. I'm talking a huge ocean liner of smoothies. Anyway, your job is to take this blender, these two meats, and these two fruits, and let me know how many different smoothie combos we can make using one meat and one fruit. Ready? Let's go! Okay, drag one meat and one fruit to the blender, then click the blender button to smoothify. Bacon and watermelon. Uh, maybe you should use the lid. Try again. Hamburger and watermelon. Yeah, you know, I just had a bath. Use the lid. Bacon and apple. Mmm, underpinnings of apple. So there's a combo. Bacon apple. Let's make more smoothies. Bacon and watermelon. Bacon watermelon. Better known as blue water making. Hamburger and watermelon. <laughs> Hamburger watermelon, or as I call it, hambermelon. <laughs> Hamburger and apple. Oh, now you're just being stubborn. Use the lid. <laughs> Hamburger and apple. <laughs> you did it. You made all the combos. Yes. So that's one, two, three, four combos. Great. Ah, uh, I can see it now. Rough Ruffman's Lip Smackin' Smoothies. Four fabulous combos. That is a great name for yellow. Hey, Helga. What? You're already using the phrase for fabulous combos for your own line of makeup, so I can't use it? But, but, okay, <laughs> nothing to worry about. Maybe if we add another fruit, that'll make more combos. So I say to you, my friend, choose a fruit. <laughs> uh, strawberry. So sweet and delicious. Back to the blender. Okay, so now we have two meats and three fruits. Bacon and apple. Mmm, <coughs> bacony. So there's a combo. Bacon apple. Let's make more smoothies. Hamburger and apple. Hamburger apple. Cool. Bacon. Hamburger 
and watermelon. Hamburger watermelon. Yummy! Bacon and... Strawberry! Bacon strawberry. Or should I say, straw bacon? Hamburger and... Strawberry! <laughs> Outstanding! Okay, so that's one, two, three... Oh, wait, no, I counted that one already. Uh, uh, one, two... Ah, this is such a mess! There's got to be a better way to do this! Hey, Blossom, down in front, please. We're looking for a better way to keep track of the combos. What's that, Blossom? There is a better way? All right, so you shove everything aside. Oh, you draw a grid with the meats on the side and the fruits at the top. Oh, wait a minute. Then you put each combo in the square that matches with that meat and that fruit. Oh, it's so neat and organized. Blossom, you're brilliant. And that's one. Two, three, four, five, six combos! That's even better than four! I can see it now. Rough Ruffman's Lip Smackin' Smoothies. Six sensational combos! That is a great name for it. Yellow. Oh, hey, Bluff. What? You're already using the phrase six sensational combos for your line of frozen pizzas, so I can't use it? Okay, <laughs> just uh, another little snag. <laughs> well, well, if adding an extra fruit made more combos, then adding another meat should make even more. Right? Choose a meat! <laughs> ham! It's ham-tastic! Okay, so three meats and three fruits should get us... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine combos! Oh, wait a minute. Let's see if that's right. Test away, my smoothie friend. Ham and... Watermelon. Brilliantly watermelon-esque. So there's a combo. Ham watermelon. Let's make more ham and apple. <laughs> ham apple. Known from now on as Hample. <laughs> ham and strawberry. <laughs> but, <laughs> someone will like it, I'm sure. <laughs> Hamburger and apple. <laughs> Hamburger apple, or as I call it, Hamburg apple. <laughs> Hamburger and strawberry. Hamburger strawberry. Or should I say, strawberger? <laughs> <laughs>